Baby, I'm the gamble of your life Why you always gotta think twice? We could go at it all night Tell them on till you can't even go no more Aaron Jones! He dives in for the touchdown! This looks like a whole new Packers offense. I'm really liking what I'm seeing. Nobody will catch him. Aaron Jones has broken it open. Touchdown, Green Bay Packers. Welcome back. Joining us now, record-setting running back Aaron Jones. Aaron, welcome to the program. 23 touchdowns in a single season a new Packer record. Now, Aaron, this place has been around for like a hundred years. Can you appreciate how special it is to do something nobody else has ever done? Uh, I definitely can. I mean, this is a historic place to play at Lambeau. There's no place like it and for it to be around for a hundred years. And my name's at the top of that. It's definitely something special, but uh, I had help getting there. My offensive lineman, blocking unit, tight ends, receivers. Uh, so without them, I couldn't have done it. If you could rank on a one to 10 scale on the cool meter, some of the things you've done during the regular season. First of all, becoming a 1,000 yard rusher. One to 10 on the cool meter. 10, this 10 for me. <laughs> okay. How about tying for the league lead in rushing touchdowns with 16? Definitely 10. Uh, that was one of my goals. If I didn't tie, that would have been better, but uh, that was definitely one of my goals. So I got 10. a feeling this might be repetitious. Okay. <laughs> Tying for the league lead in total touchdowns during the regular season with 19. Same answer. Uh, 10. I wish I could have had it myself. Um, chaired that, been the solo owner, but uh, blessing to be in that position, and it was one of my goals, so definitely a 10. Okay, this might break the meter. Going down to Dallas in your home state in front of family and friends and scoring four rushing TDs and gaining 182 yards, total yards from scrimmage. Where does that rank on the cool meter? Uh, 33. <laughs> 33. Uh, no, we broke the meter. No, definitely. That was a special game. Got to go back home in front of a lot of friends and family. Got to throw a touchdown ball to my brother, four touchdowns in a game, uh, made some more Packer history. So just to be doing that, making history in a long line of history in this great, great uh, program, I mean, it's special to me. By any measure, Aaron, you just completed a breakout season. Now, do you think that was just you in year three? Was it scheme? Was it opportunity? What do you credit for that breakout season? Uh, I think it was both scheme and opportunity. Uh, just getting more opportunity to uh, get the ball in my hands uh, in different situations, whether it be the red zone, uh, being a receiver, screening game, outside zone, just finding different ways to get the ball in my hands. And then also scheme, because once they started planning for me, scheming for me, then it's like, okay, how are you going to get him the ball? What are you going to do different? And this the scheme, you never know what we're going to do. You know, don't know if I'm going to line up wide, if I'm going to come in jet motion, if they're going to toss it to me, or if I'm just a decoy. So it's, so it's so many things that you can do in this scheme, and that's why I love it. Aaron, when you're carrying the football, everything is happening at warp speed. When the play is done, can you actually remember exactly how you did it, or does it just happen? Uh, for the most part, I remember uh, what happened on the back side of things. Sometimes I don't see it clearly, so I won't uh, see what happened perfectly, or oh, I might have be off on what guy made the tackle, but I don't, I don't know if it was somewhere in the interior D-line, or I know it was a linebacker. But uh, definitely for the most part, I, I remember, uh, and I think that's how you can coach yourself out there on the field and continue to get better. Remember what the safety did or what the corner did when they went to tackle you the first time or the last two times. Aaron, what did Sergeant Major Alvin and Sergeant Major Virgis have to say about your season? And of uh, course, I'm referring to his parents there. <laughs> no, they just told me uh, how proud they are of me, um, that 
they knew that this was possible. Um, just continue to keep God first, and uh, this is just the beginning. Things are going to continue to get better for me. Aaron, even with the disappointing way in which the season ended, you guys still go 14-4 and four and wind up in the NFL's Final Four. That's big stuff. What made this team special, do you think? Uh, so just the bond. Uh, and when we faced adversity, uh, we didn't blink. Uh, we were comfortable with being uncomfortable. And uh, we always fought back. We always had each other's back. Uh, no matter the situation, we're going to go down swinging. How will you, or how do you, I should say, adjust to the off season? You're going a million miles a minute, and then suddenly it's over. How do you adjust to that? Uh, I'm not ready to go home. Uh, <laughs> I was planning on uh, being here for at least two more weeks, you know, but uh, I don't know. It's tough. Uh, I'm not used to having a lot of time off or anything, so I guess just take a couple of days off, assess things, uh, kind of probably be bored sitting there those couple of days, letting my body heal, but uh, I'll be ready to get back to work, honestly. Aaron, with all the things you did this season, and there was a bunch of great stuff, I still got to tell you, you know what my favorite Aaron Jones play was? Mm. Time's up. <laughs> the blitz pickup in the first <laughs> Vikings game. I would have put Harrison Smith down <laughs> for the mandatory <laughs> eight count. Oh, and you kept him down. Yes, sir. That was one heck of a football play. Thank you. I appreciate that. Congratulations on a great season. Enjoy your off season. Thank you for being with us.